The fifth annual Matson Memorial Classic was held on Monday, honoring the late Orange Lutheran girls basketball coach, Tony Matson. Matson passed away in April 2009 due to a heart attack. With four games featuring teams from all over Southern California, this day was a way to share the legacy Matson left. Director of Athletics, Todd Eklund. It's an opportunity to honor that and then share with others uh, just the legacy of Tony Matson um, with other schools in the community and honoring uh, a coach, uh, someone who served our, our school, the mission of our school. Tom Howard, Olu's current head coach, learned a great deal from Matson. Tony meant a lot to the school, let him, meant a lot to me. His legacy has gone well beyond the 10 years that he was the head coach here. Um, he influenced me tremendous deal and I hope that the influence he had on me has come out in, in my coaching. As is the custom, the Olu girls team played in one of the four games on the day as they battled Troy High School. Early on, they had the three ball working. First, Courtney Lofink from the top of the key. Then Sarah Stummy is going to drop one from the corner. In the second, Gloria Bates. The shake and bake for the two. And just before half, Jessica Nowicki beats the buzzer. And the Lancers go into the break down by two. Out of the break, though, the Warriors ramped up the pressure. A couple turnovers leading to some easy buckets. This backdoor cut by Barbara Sitigan. And then an offensive rebound and put back by Rebecca Lazuka. All in all, a 15-3 third quarter. And that would be enough for Troy to put this one away, 40-27. to Howard hopes to see the girls respond well from this defeat. we got to keep moving forward. Uh, our girls have battled all year long. They've been fighters. And now they're going to have to fight through a... Um, not their best performance tonight. And uh, they're going to have to come back and respond to that. And I'm looking forward to practice throughout this week where we can get back and uh, remind ourselves, remind them of who we are, um, how we've been successful all throughout the year. Olu fell to 14-5 and overall and will pick up league play next Tuesday versus Rosary at home. At the end of the day, though, this was more about remembering the legacy of a great man with one of the things he loved most, basketball. For the Orange Luther Network, I'm Dave Cacciaputi. Be more, be a Lancer.